Hey folks, uh, I'm just here with a quick Lightroom tutorial. What I want to do is uh, eliminate duplicates. Uh, well, I'm shooting now in RAW format because I want to edit using Lightroom. Uh, but what I was doing on my camera is I was shooting both RAW and JPEG and when I imported my photos into Lightroom CC, I imported both the JPEG and the RAW file. So now as you can see here, I have two images uh, in Lightroom. Um, essentially, uh, as nice as the Fuji JPEG is, uh, I want to process the uh, RAW using Lightroom. So basically we want to select all the JPEGs uh, and then come back to this view where we see the duplicates to make sure that they are in fact duplicates before we delete them. I'm going to do a search up here for JPG. I'll click on that and now I have all my May 2021 JPEGs. I'm going to select all of those by doing Command A on a Mac um, or Control A on a Windows computer. And then now I'm going to remove the JPEG search filter here. But what's cool about Lightroom is the images that I've selected right now will remain selected even if I change the uh, search uh, field up at the top. So I've removed now the filter and now I'm back to our full May 2021 view. And now we can see uh, and scroll through and make sure that the images that I am uh, deleting are in fact all duplicates. And it looks like they all are. So I'll just, you know, quickly scrolling through. And, and now we've come to the point in the month where I started. Basically in May, I stopped importing the uh, JPEG files into Lightroom and I only started importing the RAWs because there's just no benefit to having both of them for me. By selecting all of them and browsing through here, we're able to make sure, yep, all of these are in fact uh, duplicates. And now we can just go edit and delete. And that's it. Now we only have the raw files left. And that's it. So thanks for, uh, thanks for tuning in. I hope to do uh, some more uh, tutorials like this at some point. And uh, yeah, thanks guys.